Howdy y'all, I am Ice Gold, and I'm back with episode 14 for the rooftops of Barkenham Palace. This is going to be pretty much the exact same thing that I was doing. Um, <laughs> there are some interesting bosses up here on the rooftops, so let us dive straight into things. The Adventure of the Queen's Jewels. Let's begin. Oh, you've managed to catch my scent, I see. Well, I'm afraid Her Majesty is already installed in the Royal Airship and is waiting for me. Let's see if my trusted lieutenant, the dashing and dangerous Margarita Vizzini, can deliver my point. Greetings, wizard. My name is Margarita Vizzini. I am a master of the Opera Nova School of Valencia. It is my pleasure to teach you the art of this sword, and to be the last foe you'll ever face. You've done nothing but fail me, Valencian. Enjoy Newgate. Wizard, continue to follow me at your own peril. Inconceivable! I cannot believe you overcame my defenses. Truly well thought, Wizard. Grab onto the ladder to ascend up to the royal airship. Best of luck catching Dr. Jackal. He's a two-faced fiend. Next time, I'll have to fight you with my right hand. <laughs> That's crazy. Mr. Pooh, did you order up any extra cargo? Such as what, Mr. Rutherson? Say a young whelp about so high and so smart, dressed more or less like a wizard. What rot? I'd never order up such a thing. Whatever would I do with a wizard, Mr. Rutherson? Perhaps when we got high enough in the sky, you wanted to see if a wizard could fly. What a clever idea, Mr. Rodderson. What a clever idea indeed. So this one's going to be <clears throat> a little bit tougher. <laughs> For obvious reasons. I mean, I've got to somehow beat an ice boss. Uh, I'll probably troll detonate on Mr. Pool. Well, we'll see. <laughs> Maybe I'm running into this like totally unprepared, but <clears throat> best case scenario, this one's a cinch. Not likely though. I will need to keep my Colossus and faint for Mr. Utterson.
my god. <coughs> that was a nail biter. Oh, Mr. Pooh, <laughs> I never did have a head for fighting. Nor I, Mr. Rutterson. Nor I. At least, we can take some solace in knowing the control deck is locked up tight. So true, Mr. Pooh. So very true. Okay. <laughs> that was, uh, that was pretty nuts. Wow. I am surprised I'm alive. Okay. So, we got a puzzle here. What we got? The system that controls <coughs> the doors to the control deck has been tampered with. Each lever is connected to the gears in line with it. You can tell you need to use two levers to line up the gears properly. But you'll only get one chance. Who knows what will happen if you pull the wrong lever. So... Okay, hold on. There's a pleasing gear okay. noise as you flip the <laughs> correct lever and you hear the door to the control deck unbolt. You love to see that. <clears throat> I didn't even know I had just like automatically gotten it right, but I I'll rock with that. Wizard, you vex me. It is one thing to mortify curiosity, another to conquer it. I have discovered the duality of self! In doing so, I tapped into an alternate, more powerful form. One unbound by rules and conscience. Call him Mr. Hound! But I cannot maintain Hound's form for long. I am trapped in this weak, pitiful body of jackal. However, with the Queen's jewels, I can perfect my alchemical solution and become Mr. Hound forevermore. You understand the call of power, do you not? Leave me to my research, or else we will become mortal enemies. <coughs> okay. So... For this boss... We'll have to hit him when he is in his Mr. Hound polymorph. Because if we don't, he has 80 res. And he's got a lot of minions that I need to deal with, so... <clears throat> Let's see here. Um... Yeah, I'm, I'm just looking on the wiki. I'm gonna see how much health. Okay, he's actually got a lot of health as Mr. Hound. He's got 6,000, so... Yeah, I will need to just do my thing, spam some shields, and hit on ideally round five. So yeah, that's uh, that's gonna be how we do it. Hmm, he he can remove blades. So okay. I hope I get an infall, because he can cast a Lava Giant uh, when his minions die, so... Hmm. Well, I guess we'll see. Um. <laughs> Alright. <sighs> I will give it my best shot. I've just got to pray that I can... Uh, actually do enough damage all right let's go so round five is what we gotta aim for
I got we did it. <laughs> Wizard, I Let's see go. now I have done wrong. I must not force the queen or anyone else to be a subject of my research. You have taught me that the doom and burden of our life is bound on our shoulders. And if we attempt to cast it off, it returns tenfold. You must suffer me to go my own dark way. Well, how about that? <laughs> well, that was a spot of bother, wasn't it? You handled the situation cleverly, dear. Am I distraught? Of course not. One can't go to pieces at the news of every crisis from the spiral. We'd all be in a constant state of collapse. Now, bring us home, dear. Oh, you think I know how to fly the airship? I mean, I'll take the mushrooms that are just growing in it for some reason, but... Sure, I guess. Can't be too hard. Can't be too hard to pilot an airship, right, team? Gas. <laughs> we did it. You've done Marleybone a great service today, wizard. I'm sure my brother Mycroft is already informed. And I'll write up my case notes about it. How does the adventure of the Wizard League sound? Well, how about that? Everybody's uh, clapping for me. <laughs> Go crazy. Well, <clears throat> assuming there is nothing left here, that is going to wrap up. So... Thank you all for watching. I have been Ice Gold. Be sure to like, subscribe, and leave like 50 comments for the algorithm. I'll be recording episode 15 in just a few short minutes, but yeah, I will see y'all later.